OSM to Vector Tiles is an open source project to create free vector tiles from OpenStreetMap data that you can use to create your own maps. First we need to explain what tiles and vector tiles are. The idea of tiles is to divide the map into many small square images that are joined on the client side. This allows smoother user experience and has many advantages for serving the tiles fast. Since the same tiles always cover the same areas, they can be pre-computed and cached. Tiled raster maps are now replaced by vector tiles emerging as the new standard, but the same tile principles can be applied to vector data. Since clients are now more powerful, it is now possible to render the map on the device itself and only send the actual polygons, line strings, and points and their associated metadata to the client, which turns it into a beautiful map. This enables next generation user experience with styles customized for the user language, resolution, day or night time. It also means that now we can create vector tiles only once and let other developers and cartographers style them, which is the goal of OSM2 vector tiles. You can get vector tiles from commercial providers such as Mapbox, but not everyone can depend on a third party. OSM to Vector Tiles is an alternative for all those who want true open source vector tiles and complete control over the data. With OSM to Vector Tiles, you can host the tiles yourself or use them offline without having to create vector tiles. You can download vector tiles for more than 200 countries and around 700 cities, and you are still able to use the industry leading tools from Mapbox. You can use Mapbox Studio to design your maps and use Mapbox GLJS to create the best possible web maps. Due to the compatibility with Mapbox Street Vector Tiles, you can switch your already existing styles to OSM2 Vector Tiles. The Vector Tiles can be used together with the Mapbox Mobile SDKs. Since you are able to download the Vector Tiles, it is possible to create stunning mapping applications that even work offline. You can stay independent, but still create great commercial apps. With our public CDN, it's easy to get started with your first map. Visit the Maps page and copy the HTML code of a map style. Create an HTML file and paste the code. Now open the static HTML page in your browser. The displayed map is now rendered by Mapbox GLJS in the browser and using free vector tiles from the public CDN. For production use, we recommend that you host the vector tiles yourself to stay independent. To host the vector tiles yourself, choose an extract and download it. You are downloading an SQLite database containing the vector tiles. Install a tile server like the Node.js based tile server GLLite. A tile server is needed to serve the vector tiles via HTTP to web clients. Start the tile server to serve the downloaded vector tiles to the web. Visit the public endpoint to check your self-hosted vector tiles. The vector tile server gives you direct instructions how to embed the vector tiles in your map applications. And that is all you need to do to start serving your own vector tiles. We are excited to see what developers will build. Read the documentation on the website and collaborate with us on GitHub. Thanks for watching.